All right, so now we want to go over site alignment and site picture. If you can't do these two things, you won't be able to put rounds on target. And if that target's a threat, well, you're out of luck. So with all iron sights, what you're going to have is you're going to have a rear sight which has two posts and you're going to have a front sight which has a single post. And all you have to do is you have to put the front sight in between the rear sight like so and you have to make sure that the tops are all aligned in the same height and then the space on either side of the front sight post is also equal. So some people call this equal height equal light. That's not my favorite saying, but if it helps you out, then absolutely use it. Ideally, this is all we're looking at. Rear sight, front sight, the tops are aligned, and the same amount of space on either side of the front sight post. That is sight alignment. Now real quickly, some common problems that you can have is if your front sight post is off to the left, you're going to notice your round impacts are going to impact to the left of the target. Same thing if the front sight post is to the right of the rear sight, then you're going to have rounds impacting to the right of the target. Same thing goes horizontally. If you have your front sight post above the rear sight, your rounds are going to impact higher on your target. And if the front sight post is lower than the rear sight, then you're going to be having rounds impacting lower on the target. So hopefully this little drawing helps you out, kind of understand how your sights need to one, look, and two, if your rounds are impacting not where you want them to be, then it might have to do with your sight alignment amongst other things. So now let's look at sight picture. Once you know how to line up your sights properly, we want to put those onto a target or onto a threat. So let's use a regular circular target for this example. We're going to have our sights aligned and we're gonna draw a target out in the distance. We'll say it's like 21 feet out. Regardless, the sights need to be lined up on the target like so. Essentially what we're doing is we're taking the tops of the front and rear sights, lining them up horizontally and then taking that line and splitting the target in half where we want those rounds to impact. In this case, if it's a circle, it's gonna look like this. Now, there's a few exceptions with a few guns out there. I think SIGs, maybe 1911s, might be more like this. However, for most guns and probably the one that you own, this is what's going to get you on target. And to be perfectly honest, most engagements happen within 21 feet. So if you're anywhere close to the target, you're gonna have an effective impact. Now, the last thing that I want to add with sight alignment and sight picture is you want your focus to be on the front sight post. Your rear sight and your target should actually be blurry and your front sight post is, should be what is in focus. If you head out to the range and you're having trouble getting your rounds on target and where you want, don't be afraid to fall back to the fundamentals and remember, focus on the front sight, focus on the front sight, focus on the front sight. I hope this video was helpful for you. Now go and practice, 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 site alignment, site picture, and I'll see you in the next video.